Hello happy people, Hamza here and welcome back to the channel. Now in this video I'm going to show you how to cancel or manage bookings in your hotel booking website. Right now at the moment I'm into the hotel booking website dashboard and in the back end. So right here we are looking at all the available bookings that have been placed on our website. We have booking 219, booking 216 and booking 203. Now the beauty about this hotel booking engine is that you receive an email notification whenever something happens. In case a booking has been placed, a reservation, a payment, there will always be a, no a notification to you, the hotel administrator, just like this, or actually to the client also once they make a booking. Now when your client receives an email once they have placed a booking, right in their email they have the option actually to cancel their booking. And when you look at this booking, this is booking ID 19. And when you look into our bookings, it looks like this booking is actually pending payment. Okay, and the booking ID is actually booking 19. Once the client clicks on cancel your booking, it means that this booking will automatically be cancelled. Now the booking has been cancelled or the reservation has been cancelled. When I come back here to my bookings and I reload this page over here, you see that now this booking ID 19 has been cancelled. Now. That means that you, the hotel administrator, will actually receive a notification in your inbox that will actually say booking ID 19 has been cancelled. That email will tell you that booking has been cancelled and this is uh, the booking ID over here and it has actually been cancelled by the customer and when you click over here you can view the booking and in summary these are all the booking details right here. The same booking details right here are the same right here in the bookings dashboard. Not only that, once your client cancels a booking, once they go back to their inbox, they will also have received an email that says your booking 219 is cancelled. When they open that booking right here, it will detail for them all the details for that cancelled booking. Now that is on the side whereby a client actually cancels the booking. Now how about if the hotel itself wants to cancel a booking that has been placed by a client? What the hotel simply does is come back here to the dashboard, come to the bookings dashboard, where all the bookings have actually been listed. At the moment, we have two bookings that have been cancelled, but there is one booking that has been abandoned, or it can even be a confirmed booking or one pending payment. What you simply just have to do is simply click on the edit button on any of the bookings, and then it will take you to write this page over here where it will list all the details about that specific booking. Now in this case, we simply want to cancel this booking as an administrator. So you simply just come over here to status and say cancelled and then you simply update the booking. Now this will not only be updated in the bookings dialog over right here, but also the client who placed this specific booking will receive a notification in their email. So in this case, this client using this email should receive an email in their inbox, which is right here, that their booking and the booking number, which is 203 booking, booking number 203 has actually been canceled. Now that means that this booking no longer exists at this specific hotel and of course all the details will be listed right in this email to the client once that booking is cancelled. So in a nutshell that's how you can manage bookings for your hotel booking website. One on the side of the client and one there is a side of the administrator. And of course there are many other things that you can do on the booking. For example when we come over here on the edit option for the booking you can change the status to confirmed to abandoned to pending administrator approval pending payment or pending user confirmation and all the logs will be saved right here on how that specific booking has been performing right into your dashboard and of course all the customer details are listed right down here so in a case whereby you want to apply a coupon or issue a coupon to a specific client that can also be done right down here and of course you can even add a payment manually for a specific booking for a specific client Anyway, thank you so much for watching. In case you have any questions, comments regarding how to cancel or manage bookings in your hotel booking website, please let me know down in the comment box below. Otherwise, I wish you all the very best. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.